Prince Philip can't stand his former daughter-in-law Sarah Ferguson and that's the real reason the Duchess of York's trip to Balmoral was cut short, according to sensational royal claims. Richard Fitzwilliams made the explosive revelation after pictures of Sarah Ferguson, also known as Fergie, leaving the Scottish estate on Prince Philip, Duke of Edinburgh's arrival, were published. Sarah was at the Queen's Scottish home with her ex-husband Prince Andrew, also 59. However, she left early after father-on-law Prince Philip, 98, arrived before he was expected. It is believed the pair had managed to patch things up after Prince Andrew and Sarah's daughter Princess Eugenie married last year. But Mr. Fitzwilliams told, it is instructive that Sarah Ferguson has left Balmoral so soon, the Duke of Edinburgh, rightly, cannot stand her. The Duchess of York's relationship with her father-in-law broke down in 1992 after shocking pictures emerged of her with Texan billionaire, John Bryan. Philip struggles to be in the same room as Sarah and hasn't forgiven the Duchess following the 1992 toe-sucking scandal, which caused the breakdown of her marriage to his son, Prince Andrew. Fergie was holidaying in St. Tropez with her lover John Bryan in 1992 when paparazzi caught the pair in the rather embarrassing position. She was staying at Balmoral when the shocking images were published and the Windsors came across them in the morning newspapers at the breakfast table. Her relationship with her in-laws, particularly the Duke of Edinburgh, was left in tatters. The shocking moment paved the way for the Duchess' exit from the royal family, who were left furious. Sarah has made a seismic effort to repair her damaged relations with the royals. Mr. Fitzwilliams previously said, Sarah Ferguson has made a seismic effort to regain some of the royal favor she so catastrophically lost. This wedding is her chance to excel and she will be seated with the family. No one has forgotten the past but on this occasion she will be fated as the mother of the bride. Sarah and Andrew, who have two daughters, Princesses Beatrice and Eugenie, still remain firm friends and even share a residence, the Royal Lodge, their family home in Windsor. It comes after it emerged the Duchess was scared of her father-in-law Prince Philip in the years before their relationship broke down after her 1992 affair. Speaking in a recently unearthed 1997 clip of Fergie, Downfall of the Duchess, Alan Starkey, author of Fergie, Her Secret Life, said, the person she was most afraid of in the royal family was Prince Philip. Earlier on in the marriage, he had told her now you're a member of the firm you can do anything you want, but you'll always be found out. And she was always frightened about that. During the 2016 interview, which has resurfaced, Sarah Ferguson also spoke about sharing the royal lodge with her ex-husband Prince Andrew. Prince Andrew has reportedly jetted off on private escape with ex-wife Sarah following news his friend Jeffrey Epstein was found dead in prison last weekend. The pair were staying at the Queen's Balmoral estate with family at the weekend, after Prince Andrew faced scrutiny over his friendship with billionaire Jeffrey Epstein. Mr. Epstein was found dead in his jail cell on Friday, where he was being held as he waited to go to trial over a series of sex trafficking allegations. He reportedly hanged himself at Metropolitan Correctional Center in Manhattan, New York. The Duke was seen boarding a private jet in Aberdeen Airport on Tuesday, dressed in a smart suit as several bags were loaded onto the aircraft. A royal source insisted, the Duke of York didn't leave Balmoral early, his departure yesterday was as planned.